The John Toya Cancer Center is a very unique cancer center experience. The way we were designed was that everybody should be very, very good at very, very little. That's one. Two is we don't have interns or residents or fellows here. So all the patients are seen by full-time attending staff in the respective subspecialty areas. Three years, we're into we, not me. Everything is a team concept. The patients are exposed to the team every time they come. The entire multidisciplinary group meets on a weekly basis. You have the radiation doctors, the medical oncologists, the imagers, the pathologists, everybody involved in breast is in that room. And we review all of the patients to make sure we're all on the same page. One of the great things about the place is that there are so many patients coming through that we have enough to ask some of the most interesting questions out there now. Study after study has shown that uh, patients with cancer do um, better with surgeons and as well as their other care providers who focus just on that disease process, that there's actually a survival benefit to having subspecialist uh, care for you rather than generalists. There's no doubt practice makes perfect, and so doing these at such a volume uh, improves my skill, improves the knowledge base, improves the outcomes. In breast cancer, one of the things we're really interested in is avoiding uh, cardiac irradiation. Irradiating the heart can lead to problems for the patient that don't have anything to do with breast cancer. So there are a couple of techniques to do that, and one is the prone position. And not all centers are able to do the prone position, but here at John Thur Cancer Center, we can. The prone breast table has a hole in it that we place on the side of the affected breast. So what essentially happens is that the breast will hang by gravity through the hole, and that way breast tissue is pulled away from the chest wall, and you can treat what you want and miss what you don't want to treat. Well, what's unique about our program is that we have eight radiologists who are dedicated to breast imaging. 100% of our screening patients will get 3D mammography, which is a great advantage for our patients because this decreases callback rate and in turn decreases anxiety for the patients, and it also has an improved cancer detection rate. The concept of personalized oncology care is here. It's here with genomic testing to see if all people need chemotherapy or not. It's now next generation gene sequencing. Can we find a drug to target that gene mutation? To be able to look at a particular breast cancer patient's tumor and look at that cell and see exactly what kind of chemotherapy that that particular cell might be sensitive to, then maybe we can avoid the shotgun whole body uh, approach and really just focus on going after the Achilles heel, if you will, of that particular tumor. The next generation is in radiation oncology and here at the John Thurer Cancer Center is higher doses to smaller targets treating the thing that the patient needs treated with as high a dose of radiation as possible and sparing normal tissues, and doing that as accurately as possible. We're very interested in quality of life of patients, and that has a lot to do with decreasing toxicities of the treatments. I feel better when patients feel better. <laughs>